Hi there, I'm Tom Lehman, the Doe Doctor, and we're in uh, Columbus, Ohio right now. We're at the 2010 NAPIC show, and uh, we're just getting ready for the show opening tomorrow. We're setting up the Avantech oven. We're going to see what it's going to do with a couple pizzas that we're getting ready to put in. This here for our show, we're going to be showing different types of pizzas being made. Again, we're going to use the Avantech oven. And part of the theme this year is other things that you can do with your pizza dough. Everybody makes a basic pizza dough, but rather than just making pizzas, we're going to show people how to make everything from specialty calzones, not the standard folded calzone, but what we call a house calzone. We're also going to be making uh, sweet rolls. When was the last time you saw cinnamon rolls being made at a pizzeria? They can be a real popular item, especially if you're getting maybe getting into the breakfast trade. Nothing goes better than coffee and a cinnamon roll in the morning. You don't need to make a special dough. You can modify it. We're going to show you how to do that. You can also make filled uh, calzones. That would be appropriate for breakfast. Make all different types of things. And we're going to show those tomorrow. But today we're just going to be running some pizzas through the oven, just fine tuning the oven, getting it set up so it'll be, be running just great for all of our work tomorrow. While we're waiting for the pizzas to come out, I'd like to show you a couple features about the Vantech oven here. Uh, first of all, the oven that we're working with has a split conveyor. And the Vantech is common in that we have both a top and bottom conveyor running through a single cavity. And in this case, each, each cavity has a split conveyor, which gives us the potential for four different baking times. Baking temperature would always be the same, but baking times can vary. So we can utilize this for different types of products. So if there's a slight change in baking time, we need to bake one longer or shorter. We don't need to do anything different. We can leave one conveyor set up for baking pizzas. We can use another one for baking another product. So this is one of the neat things about this particular type of an oven. Uh, another unique feature to this type of an oven is the fact that we have got our air plates, which are very easily blocked off. So if we need to reprofile the oven or reconfigure the fingers in the oven, we don't need to purchase specialty fingers or have an additional set of fingers laying around someplace. We can simply move a couple block off plates around on the oven and we can reprofile it to bake exactly whatever we need to do. Since this oven has split conveyors, we have our top conveyors and our bottom conveyors and we have left and right, front and back, so we can control each one of these independently. So for example, if I wanted to speed up the oven a little bit, or slow it down, I can slow it down, or I can speed it up. I can do that with any one of the four conveyors. Our baking time today is, we're set at 465, so we're actually running at 462, which is close enough. We've got product getting ready to come out of the oven right now. A couple of things to keep in mind about any of the conveyorized ovens uh, from any manufacturer, and that is that consistency is the name of the game. You get a consistently uniform bake, time after time after time. And you've also got great production capacity. There you go, a great looking pie in five and a half minutes. I wish you could be here right now to hear this. You can actually hear it crisp. You can actually hear it crunch as we're cutting it. Proof of any good quality pizzas, look at the bottom. 
See if it's nice and brown. We know it's crispy and crunchy. You could hear it crunch when we cut it. You can see here we've got a nice brown color. Matches the top quite nicely. You couldn't ask for a more uniform bake. Remember the old adage, the proof of the pudding is in the eating. That's good pizza.